Hi, I'm Ollie. In this video we're going to take a look at multitasking on the Samsung Galaxy Note 2. So what we do is if you hold down the back key, you get this menu at the side. You can edit this using the edit function and choose anything you prefer to be there. So just as an example, what we'll do is we'll load up the gallery. And if we start playing this video, if you pop back to your menu at the side, if uh, for example we want to browse the internet, so using Chrome, just drag that over and it does a 50-50 split. So you can use the uh, web browser there, you can continue watching your video. If you want to make that a bit smaller so you can see more of this browser. If you do want to type something in, you tap on there, you get a smaller keyboard up here at the bottom, which is also movable, so you've got full control of everything like that, which is uh, obviously awesome. Once you're finished with the keyboard, you can tap back on the screen there and that disappears. Obviously you can easily pick another application. Uh, if we just scroll down and we decide we want to use Google Talk, drag that into the bottom window and that replaces uh, the video that was playing, yet you've still got your internet browser open at the top. I think it's uh, that key there. Now, there is a way as well where you can flip between the, uh, the two windows, which is really useful. Uh, mainly watching videos, it means you can keep your um, web messaging open at the same time as, say, texting someone. So there is uh, endless possibilities with this feature. Just take a little bit of getting used to flicking between, but all in all, really impressed with it. So uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's multitasking on the Samsung Galaxy Note 2. If you're interested in more Note 2 videos, if you subscribe to my channel, I'll keep you updated. If this video has helped, if you could like on YouTube, and any questions, just ask below. Thanks for watching.